girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to be talking about diaries. Now, a little quick story time. I remember when I got my first diary. It was like when um, I turned 11 years old. I was at my cousin's house, and one of my early birthday presents that I got what from one of my cousins was my very own diary. And it was a really nice diary. It was like pink and black and it had like a zebra print P for my initial for Presley. And I was really thankful for this gift. I also got like a Bruno Mars CD because back when I was like 11 years old, when I turned 11, I was really um, into Bruno Mars. I liked listening to his music, but nowadays I don't listen to much of Bruno Mars. I just listen to a lot of rock music and pop music and a little bit of rap. Not too much rap though. Just whatever I feel like listening to. Anyway, back to the story. So as soon as I got my first diary from my cousin, I immediately started writing in my diary because I was so excited. I just wrote whatever just came to mind in that diary because it was really interesting having a diary around and writing down whatever you want to write down, like your own secrets. And some people like to put down their deepest, darkest secrets that they don't want to tell anyone. But some people consider their diary as like their own best friend who keeps secrets, help like you can tell your diary anything and it can just keep that secret. And it's really interesting, come to think about it. I really like it. But as soon as I got older, like 12, 13, 15, 16, years went by and I just didn't write in my diary that much. Like a few months pass by, I write in my diary a little bit. A year passes by, I write in my diary a little bit. Like the vacations I went to, certain events that happened throughout school and not a whole lot of things just got really interesting that I wanted to put in my diary and just everything just got all a little boring and stuff. But as soon as I created this YouTube channel, Peaceful Presley, I realized I could talk about different topics and crazy stories throughout my life. And this YouTube stuff really changed my life and I really enjoy talking about different topics and crazy stories throughout my life because I like to entertain y'all. Even if me talking a whole bunch isn't entertaining, I still like to, you know, talk and publish things. YouTube nowadays is like my own personal diary. Even if it's not a, um, a private diary, this is more of a public diary for millions of people to see and enjoy watching my content and listen to me talk. And some people can actually relate to my videos. And I'm really thankful for that because it's really nice to relate to a whole lot of people on this platform. And this platform is a blessing and I am thankful to have this YouTube channel but I'm worried about getting it terminated. If I end up, there ain't no way I'm gonna violate terms and services because I'm doing my best to get with the program and follow the rules because YouTube has its own rules, but sometimes YouTube can get a little carried away and end up demonetizing stuff that's like unnecessary or deleting things that's unnecessary add in copyright strikes for anything unnecessary, which is completely insane. But I don't have to worry about it right now. What I need to worry about is what I'm doing right now, is entertaining you guys and sharing my thoughts and feelings to the world. And I am very happy about that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.